appears to be considered in relation to religious education this summer term in our church schools. How much clarity is there in your understanding between syllabus requirements and curriculum design? How does RE relate to your school vision and your curriculum intent? What does your website say about your current teaching of RE? We encourage RE leads to register for the termly one hour update outlining current developments, both within the diocese, across Church of England schools and the national landscape of religion and worldviews. For schools currently following Explore RE, the Essex Agreed Syllabus, information in relation to the new syllabus, an overview of implementation with support will be disseminated via the SLIS partnerships and through Essex Infolink. There will also be a monitoring form in relation to RE provision and collective worship provision that will shortly be sent to all schools and we encourage you to complete this. For aided schools within the diocese, a reminder that we no longer recommend or promote the Chelmsford Diocesan Syllabus. All aided schools should have received an invitation from myself to attend a question and answer session on Friday the 7th of May in the afternoon. This is an opportunity to hear updated information in relation to the current landscape and developments. If you have not received this email, please contact me directly and I will ensure that the team's link will be sent out to you towards the end of next week. If there are any specific questions you would like address, these can also be included in the email. To hold an informed and balanced conversation in relation to religion and worldviews remains our focus through a multidisciplinary approach, exploring ways we encourage pupils to engage with believing, thinking and living. And during 2021-22, we will be planning to work collaboratively with schools to develop some specific diocesan units. These will support our schools beyond the syllabus that they follow. And we will continue to hold our RE LEAD meetings virtually. Thank you.